Tim Krugel is with us here on the John Mandola Show. Uh, baseball player here at Holy Redeemer, but also an ice hockey player, busy guy. Do you have a favorite between uh, each sport? Uh, I've played ice hockey as long as I've been playing baseball, but um, baseball's always been my favorite. Ever since I was little, I picked up a baseball, and that's been my go-to. Nice size. There's some guys on this squad with nice size. Talk a little bit about you know having guys that you know are good athletes on this team. Yeah, definitely. There's good horses in the league overall, yeah. but you guys are hanging with all of them. Yeah, I mean, size is definitely big. I mean, you step into the box, a pitcher sees size, you know, it's intimidating. And we have the size, we have the speed, we have everything that we need, the athleticism. Um, everything's coming together really well with us. I mean, we're, it's a brotherhood here, so... I think we're playing really well. We're doing really well, and we have the size and athleticism to, to comply with that. All right, we see the gear here. Let's go up here. Okay, catcher. <laughs> you got some pitchers on this squad. Yeah. Talk about who, who the live arms are. Uh, Dudek's been, been lights out this year. I mean, he hits the spots. He's been mid to upper 80s. Um, then we've got relief guys like Tyler Hadel. Brett Kugler comes in, shuts the door. And then we got like uh, sophomores, underclassmen that can come in and shove too. And then... On top of that, Griffin, another starter that's that's really been throwing well too. So I mean, I think our pitching staff is definitely probably one of the best in the state. Big numbers on this. Uh, I mean, coach said, "Hey, we're in the 30s, which is awesome." Talk a little bit about what it's like to, to have a big squad, knowing Coach Ritzik. K, hey, he's like, "This is the biggest numbers we've had here at Holy Redeemer." Yeah, I mean, it's good. I, I the numbers are great. I mean, it's having having so many people on the bench, the energy. Everything about it. I mean, being there, everyone's there for you on this team. I mean, the bench is always, always lively. The kids are always lively. It's good to have enough underclassmen and upperclassmen. Just, it's a lot of kids, though. It's good. How about your skill set as a baseball player right now? What's, what do you feel like? Okay, hey, I'm doing really well here. But always, it is an area to improve on. Um, I think uh, during the beginning of the season, I was struggling a little bit hitting. I think I was trying to do too much. So first couple games, you know, I wasn't doing too well. Uh, came to practice the next week, really simplified my swing, simplified my game, and then ever since then I've been I've been hitting really well. Uh, catching wise, I've I've just been sticking to the same thing, uh, catching really well too. So, a couple games I've been playing right field. I play right field for travel, so I'm used to it out there. And if Coach Ritzik needs me in the outfield, he needs me behind the dish wherever. I'm ready to go wherever. We could go up and down this league. Nanico, Blake Lehman, and Sam's got some players who said, you know, Wyoming area. Talk about some of the squads that you're facing, knowing that the pitching is usually so good. It's going to be an interesting yeah. ball game well, every time you guys hit the diamond. <laughs> well, I mean, I think I have a little bit of an upper hand. Um, Derek Cease, Nick Matz, and I play travel ball with all those guys. So all winter we were we had live at bats. We we I faced all of them already. So coming into games, my comfortability level is. It's there, so I know I can hit them. Most of these guys, I try and tell them what they throw, how they throw, and it's just, it's communication. It's, we all work together. We work together to get the wins. We work together to get on base, everything. It's, it's good. All right, great to catch up with you, Kim. Thank you.